I'm Todd Deacon, and I'm being joined by James Beatty at Isolate In, brought to you by Kingfisher. Now, James, I'm going to ask you to talk us through your dream pub team, featuring you and four players from your career that you'd be happy to share a pint with. Now, uh, with this, I want you to talk through your other teammates that you'd pick. Maybe it's because you'd love to share a pint with them and you've had fond memories of that and they, you know full, full well that you're gonna have a brilliant time. Or it could be the fact you're choosing them because you know how tasty they are. So uh, let's have it then. The pub team, the dream pub team with James Beatty. Right, okay. So what, what you've just described there, I've taken into account both. Okay. All right, because I didn't know which way you wanted me to do it, so I've, I've done both. Uh, I've, got lo- I've got a lot of subs. <laughs> and then I've got, I've got a lot of people waiting in the bar. <laughs> okay. So, in got, I've, I've written a team out, look. I've got it all look on paper. That. that is effort. I love that. Um, so, in goal, I've got Jonah, Paul Jones. Um... Very good keeper, Wales international, and you know uh, the thing is about this, we've got as I mentioned previously, we've got a great ex Saints group, uh, and there must be forty ex players in there, mm. and and it's great. We we do stuff together, we we play games and and raise money for charity, and and then obviously we we go and have a, you know a drink together, um, so the, these are a mixture of the lads that are in that group. And, and the, the players that I've played with, obviously. Um, so Jonah in goal, because um, Jonah's a good keeper and he, he likes to have a, a drink and a good laugh uh, after the game. Left, I've gone for a two, a two one one one. So two okay. defenders. So on the left side of defence, uh, Bridgie. Um, I don't really need to ma- mention his playing credentials. Um, but I enjoy going out with Bridge and Bridgie and socialising with him because uh, he's a good lad um, and he, he enjoys a drink. Um, on the right side of defence, I go Klaus. Okay. Very underrated player when we when we were uh, when we were playing together and in the team. Um, really tough to get past in training. Really strong, even though he was quite wiry and, and thin. He was really long levered um, and lean. And then I've got Tiz playing in behind me. Because <clears throat> you said I had to be in the team, I wouldn't have put myself in it otherwise. Um, but the supply line coming from Tiz, we, we play a lot together even now in, in five aside. So I'm trying to remember how we play and how we set up um, and just give Tiz the ball. And then I just make runs and he just finds me. And then I just put it in. Um, and t- and Tizzy's Tizzy's weapon of choice, unfortunately, isn't Kingfisher, but it, it's Malibu and Coke, uh, and he like he likes it in a pint glass, though, so he he drink it, <laughs> drink it in pints. Um, and then yeah, me up me up top. Okay, perfect, uh, perfect team there. So go on, go on. You've 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 written it out. You've probably got tactics and, and substitutions that you're going to make. But who's no, who's on the well, subs bench? Well, on the subs bench, I've got. Stuart Ripley. Okay. Um, David Howells is on the bench. He, but he won't thank me for that, but that's all right. At least he's there. Um, David was in the Hilton when I first signed. So he was in the Hilton Hotel. Um, and when I first signed, it was the first time I'd moved away from my parents. So I was there on my own. Um, and David just signed. But he was 30 and I was 20 and he was sort of like a big brother and showed me the ropes and that and we're still really good mates now. I've got a lot of respect for Dave. Um, Nicky Banger, uh, who, who I see a lot on the on the ex saint scene, still got a little bit about him on the pitch as well. Um, and, a, and a real good character, you know, good lad. Glenn Cockrell, who you'll know. Um, same again. Glenn's a little bit slower, loves a Rod Stewart impression. but. He's, uh, you know, all, all of these are, are good lads. Mark Blake, and then the substitute goalkeeper would be Wayne Shaw. Okay. Uh, so Shaw, Shaw, he just stands there now and you can't get past him. Resounding success there on your dream uh, pub. Was it fun to do that though, James? Yeah, we, we, I do it a lot. 
when you know when you when you're in the, when you're in working and stuff like that, just tinker with different people in different positions. I like I like to write them down. <laughs>